Good morning, everybody. Good morning. From Fe Newmarket on Fergus. Fergus on Newmarket. Newmarket on Fergus, I think. Okay. We're not sure. <laughs> right, the plan is today we're going to try, well, it's early. We're going to go into Limerick. Try. <laughs> try. There is a car park, especially for the cas castle, the King's, King John's Castle, which is right in the centre of Limerick. It's Saturday, it's going to be hard to get in there. So hopefully, though, if we do, there's lots of other things to do. Hopefully, too. hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> we can make a full day just in Limerick. Um, but yeah, it doesn't open till 10, doesn't the castle? So we're going to get in the car park about quarter past half past nine. Hopefully, and get a space. Can't wait. <laughs> so, we parked last night under a conker tree, didn't we, Mazzy? We did. We did actually hear some dropping during the evening, yeah. didn't we? <laughs> it was very nice. <laughs> yeah. And this morning, I was just stood out here and I saw one drop. There was a big crash. It made a right racket. And one dropped there, and here it is. <laughs> Check this out. It's like a double conker. That is beautiful. So, we're going to keep that, aren't we? Yeah. Very autumn yeah, I love that. That can sit next to our pumpkin. It, it just can, have like yeah. an autumn theme. Oh yeah, that's good. <laughs> we need a tangerine as well. Oh no, that's Christmas, isn't it? <laughs> right, let's uh, crack on. Let's get there, Mazzy. This yeah. is some. If we can't get parked, God knows what we're going to be doing today. Okay, I'm not quite ready yet. Okay. <laughs> Five minutes. I can't believe how quiet it is in the centre of Limerick. 11 minutes past nine in the morning. The it's looking you know, good for us, isn't it? Well, you know by now, Mazzy, nobody in Ireland gets up before <laughs> 10 o'clock. That is one thing we've noticed. Look at this piece of art on the wall. Oh, I can't see it. Yeah, the Irish d just don't want to get out of the bed in the mornings, do they? No. Why is it locked? Does it open at 10? Alright, <laughs> where does that leave us? Well that's just stupid. The museum yeah. opens at 10 but the car park doesn't open till 10. Why doesn't the car park open at quarter to 10 for example? Is there anywhere we could pull in and wait? We're going to pass the time away and pop to a supermarket, aren't we? I'm going to try. We could do with some petrol anyway as well. I've only just noticed that's low. It's not low, it's got a light on it. <laughs> yeah, bye. don't worry me and panic me. Yeah, this looks like on the map we're on like now a little island. It, it is an island, yeah. We're crossing this bridge, it's, it's weird. Now, this is where we want to go, this super value, yeah. but I'm not sure it's going to be any good for parking. Any try. Show everybody what you got. <laughs> I used to love them as a kid, and it's an Halloween one. That is so cute. I didn't even know you'd got it. So what is that? Lucky buy. It's a lucky dip. Why are mummies so tense? Uh, I don't know. Because they're all wound up. <laughs> That's very good. Yeah. I ain't got my money's worth yet. I hope the other jokes are better. Random horses. Oh, they're lovely, aren't they, babe? In 200 yards, yeah. turn right onto Island. It's like you just said, I don't know why they're not running off. Yeah, it's quite They're strange. not tied down. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, I give up, man. I bet it's just Monday to Friday, isn't it? Oh, it's not open today. There's a sign on it. They might have it closed for COVID or something stupid. I don't know. <laughs> oh, does that mean the castle itself's closed, or? Oh. No, the castle's open, but we're never going to get back now. I think we'll try and find somewhere better for them. Okay. So that was Limerick. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> <laughs> it's too late now, it's what, half past ten. All the parking spots are taken because everyone gets up at ten o'clock. Thank you very much, St. St. John's. Um, King John's Castle in Limerick for not having your car park open for absolutely no reason whatsoever. Um, you've just lost two tickets and a very good review from us. So what we're going to do... That's very negative. It is negative, Mazzy. It deserves a lot of negatis negativity. No, do you know what? There's always a positive from a negative. And the positive is now we're going to the most beautiful village in... It's Dare. Adair? Adair. 
Adair. Well, I don't know. I just it was an Adair website. It says it's the most beautiful village or something in Ireland. Well, there we go. We'll enjoy that instead. Hopefully, I bet we can't get parked there either. But we'll fingers crossed. Let's just do this. Stay positive. Stay today. positive. I can't see. You know, we're hey, here. keep your distance. Keep your distance. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Right, we're in Trilly. No, we're not. Where are we? Adair. Adair. <laughs> Adair. You said Trilly because he's just ordered some contact lenses to pick up from there, didn't you? Yeah, which is going to be <laughs> in a few days. Maybe a week. Um, yeah, this, I was reading on the website that it's one of the most picturesque villages in Ireland. And so far it looks so beautiful. I'm impressed. It does, but I think that's mainly because Wow. It's sunny, Mazzy. It's no, I sunny. mean like all the fat roof little cottages there. You've got like a church or cathedral thing there. An abbey. An or abbey, a church. yeah. Yeah, it looks a very nice place actually. What's this here? Fountain, which isn't on. 1855. Yeah, very nice architecture around here. So we're going to start at this very end of Adair. Beautiful, you can see the thatch cottages there. Uh, I love the name of that place. Bakery over there, over there. It's uh, oh, a wine bar, Oak and Apple. What a beautiful name. Yeah. All these thatched roofs. We've got a deer cottage there. Look, we're, we're going to cross over and have a look anyway. Adair, it's not a deer. Adair, Adair. I might yeah. be saying it wrong myself, but I'm sure it's not a deer. <laughs> Picturesque, isn't it? Very pretty. What do you think, babe? I'm liking it. It's just we're not in it. We've started right at the outskirts. Yeah, but this is where the nice, pretty bit is. Bear with it, bear with it. What have we got here? Look, a deer cottage shop. I mean, that's so cute. You don't see that every day. It's a waste of a shop. <laughs> What's the point in having a shop if you're not going to say what you sell inside the shop? Turn this one into a little restaurant. Very nice. Cow. Babe, I'm recording. <laughs> Just get the hell out of me. <laughs> I'm finishing off with the Blue Door restaurant. I wonder why they called it a Blue Door restaurant. You actually think that's a pear tree? They're pears. I don't care what you say. <laughs> it's not pears. Actually, yeah, you are right. There is something strange going on. Don't look there. like pears. No, do not eat them. <laughs> it's got to be a pear tree, has it? Is there a partridge in there? So it looks like this is the little local park. We're going to walk through down to the town. It's looking really pretty. Lovely bandstand, look, all thatched. Very nice. Now in the town centre, and there's another like, lovely little cottage, and it's so pretty, look. All full of flowers down the street. Dan's happy now because we're heading into town finally. I don't know what it is you're looking for today. It's very posh, isn't it? A day. Very nice, yeah. Incredibly posh. It's the kind of place where if we find a charity shop, the things in the charity shop are going to be more expensive than buying them brand new in another town. It is a nightmare for one reason is this place. The road. The road. It's just constant traffic. Just trying to cross to the other side. No zebra crossing There's at all. No zebra crossings. No. Oh, there is one right in front of us, but apart from that one, <laughs> yeah. Oh, is there? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> really hard to cross the road. A little antique shop. Are we going to go and have a look? Can we just show you the kind of stuff they've got. We haven't got the mansion for it, but we'll have a look. Oh, look at that cabinet over the back there. Wow. Oh. Looks almost oriental Japanese, doesn't it? Mm. Dan just spotted this look. Lovely little picture. Yeah, I don't know how they do art, but I do like that. It's like two trolls. Or oh, hags. Would you say hags? Hags. Trolls. I like trolls. 
Yeah, it's like a gypsy wagon, isn't it? Well, what would you put in there? Tea, biscuits, mm. butter, I don't know. <laughs> Very nice. There's two of them. There's two of them. So we've come through a couple of rooms and this place is packed out. Babe, I just realised there's an upstairs as well. Yeah. There's oh, an upstairs as well. So you're after some kind of little I'd like, newish. Yeah, I'd like a little memento. It has to be something very small. Yeah. Well, that would be cool. Or maybe that. Yeah, do you know, Put that I on just dashboard. saw that. Yeah, <laughs> mantle clock. <laughs> God, that is one big mantle clock. That lovely decanter set there. Yeah, that's nice. All intact by the looks of it as well. I've just spotted, though, what all this lot is actually sitting on. See the lovely cast iron bench there? Mm. <laughs> it's gorgeous. Don't know if they're original or expensive, but I do like these, the way these are gilded. It's lovely. Have you seen these two, babe, look? Very unusual, isn't they? Oriental again, aren't they? Yeah. This is my kind of thing, Mazzy. What is that? <clears throat> Just yeah. loads of stuff. <laughs> stuff. You just want to get your hands on it and cast iron as well. With your gorilla glow. <laughs> really good stuff that. Looking at the art. Art. <laughs> I don't do art. Hey, I like that one though. That is lovely. Oh, that's unusual, isn't it? Very modern. All the fishermen look. Yeah. It's nice. The rooms are just so huge. It's like you just don't know where to look, do you? <laughs> I haven't seen prices on things actually, have you? Uh, a few things, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, it looks like it goes all the way down there too. So, a quick little game. I've spotted something I absolutely love. I'm going to see if Dan can pick out my good taste. Was it this? <laughs> no. Uh, what is it? Some kind of deeds. That don't look original. <laughs> Well, all I can think is you mean that. No, you failed the test. It was this, this little cabinet with the drawers. <laughs> that's nice. That reminds me of a few places we've been. Actually, that's the pencil place we went to, babe. They call it the pencil or something. Do you remember when we went there? We've been to a few, around towers, I don't know. Loving all this mother and pearl inlay. It's really nice. Wow, you, you're actually excited. What's, what's, Let's get oh, that. Wow. It's got a bow and everything, look. Look at the size of that thing. That's huge, isn't it? You could have a go. It's only got four strings, isn't it? Yeah, I could do that. If you've got a grand house, you know, there is some nice odds and ends in here, isn't there? Absolutely beautiful things, yeah. if you've got a big house. Yeah. Come on, let's see if there's any anything Halloween-y, Mazzy. We're going to make a special Halloween video, I think. OK. A special Halloween video, I well, think. Say no more for now. OK. <laughs> let's go in and have a look. No, I don't we need two of those, don't we? We do need two of those, and they are bad. I wonder how much they are. I've only seen one. Yeah. We could do have a cup holder on them, though, really, couldn't we? Oh, uh, yeah. Beer older, you mean? Yeah. Look, we've got some Halloween stuff here. Just check this out, Mazzy. We have to show this. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's a stand here with every kind of brush you could ever imagine to do everything. Um, brush for lint brush. and animal hair. Yeah. Vegetable brush. Dish brush. But this is the best look. It is a brush. It's a comb and brush cleaner. It's to clean your brush. <laughs> <laughs> That's fantastic. We don't need no more of this. We haven't got any. We've only got a tiny little bit and look at that, that'll last me for a week. Ah. Proper big one. No, please, we don't need that. That one's waterproof, Mazzy. Waterproof? Waterproof patch and seal tape. Oh, right. That's cool, isn't it? There is a castle in our day over here somewhere. Is it that though? Because if it is that... Well that's a school, it doesn't mention a castle. It does look castle-ish. Very posh school, St Nicholas National School. Yeah. 
there. Over there you've got a, a friary. We can see it. We can see it, but there's a <laughs> sign over there saying no entry over this bridgey bit. I don't know. There's no paths to walk, basically. <laughs> and the walk here has been all along the main road with cars just going past constantly, which is completely spoiling this beautiful little village. And you've got this here, which is the poshest place I've ever seen in my life. There's two men with top hats on. The golf course. Like proper waiters, and we think it's a golf course. No, it is the golf course. It hasn't even got a sign on it saying what it is, it's that posh. You say this is a dovecot? That's what the sign said, yeah. Well, let's go have a look inside. I think it's this yeah. way, Mazzy. I think we just passed a wedding. We've got a feeling it might be someone famous, don't we? Yeah, there's like filming crew there. Really professional looking. <laughs> I'll let you go in. <laughs> oh, where are you? It's full of flies, no doves. What's it like in there? It's a bit too well done out for my liking, is it? Mazzy. But oh. it's old, 700 years old, is really? that? Yeah. Wow, it's in good nick for that, isn't it? That's what I mean, I think they've over restored it. But they haven't really so much on the outside, have they? Mm. Oh, look, look, look. <laughs> oh, you scared. <laughs> Can I help you? It's got like a tufty bit under there, isn't it? Yeah, like a bearded crow. Is there such a thing? I don't know. just made that up? <laughs> I've heard of a bearded dragon. <laughs> Are they real? Yeah. The word, the word I'm looking for is idiot. <laughs> stupid, stupid woman. Honestly, there's loads of parking spots in this car park. She has parked next to us. On top of her. Right on top of us. She could hardly squeeze out of her door. And she's gone over to the ticket machine over there, which is actually an electric vehicle charging point. <laughs> Unbelievable. <gasps> Some people, you just can't help them, can you? <sighs> I'm going to try and squeeze back into the car now. Let's see how she gets on. Look, look, see the door opening there? Can she squeeze in that little gap? Can you do it? Go on. The annoying thing is, though, we can't now leave, can we? No, we can't move until she does. So, my little slush puppet. Are you filming me? No, I am filming you. <laughs> uh, you decided to take over the jobs in the van, didn't you? Really? I just thought it'd be a job I'd like to fix, yeah. Um, what you've done is fill this up with what? Um, filler. Wood filler. If you remember, guys, we had a big hole in this table. And you've been sanding it down and now you're giving it a layer of what? A layer of PVC to protect it. And I'm going to do a couple of layers, so it's protected. It actually looked very, very good, the job you'd done on that, Mazzy. Very well done. Oh. Babe, it should look better when it's dry too, so, yeah. <laughs> We're on a campsite, by the way. Oh, gosh, yeah, we haven't told them. We haven't told them, have we? We're on a no. dare campsite. Oh, it's so lovely round here, isn't it? It is very, very peaceful. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm just trying to get the page up for you to have a quick look. This is the campsite. A dare camping caravan and motorhome park. And it officially closes today. I did just ask him though, he says how many nights are you staying? I said just one. So, And he did say there's a couple of people oh. coming in through the week anyway. So it's still open, sort of. But yeah, it's a very, very nice, peaceful, quiet motorhome park. It's got some, it's got hedges around the edge so you feel quite private. Got electric and everything for yeah. what, 25 euros. Very happy. So, finally relaxing with John. <laughs> Thanks to our new friends. Yeah. Um, and I'm nearly ready for my tea, Mazzy. Really? No, you're not. I am. Really? Yeah. Shall we show everybody what you got? Go on then. So these are my meals for the next two days. I don't know what it is about this happy pair, but they're very expensive for what you get. I mean, it's quite small. It is small. Yeah. Oh, five euros. So I'm just guessing they are absolutely beautiful. Um, but they're a big range of the happy pear. Yeah, I'm not sure. But not chili sure. con carne, I quite fancy chili con carne. But then we saw this. Rogan Josh stir fry. Look, it's got fruit on it. So that's me fat. You've probably got me five a day on top of that. 
So that's really nice. And I was going to have this this morning, I forgot. Chicken and stuffing sandwich. And you just went, Ugh, why because did you do that? I love chicken and stuffing with cranberry. And if I'd known you, they, they had them, I probably would have picked one up. Well, you can <laughs> you can have it, Mazza. Oh, it's okay, shall I show them what I've got? Yeah, yeah. Better be good. Yeah, it's not great. To tonight's tea, because my belly hasn't been too good, so I'm going to be having... Fruit, salad, lots of fruit, and some blueberries. Blueberries? Ooh, look at them. What oh, are actually, they? there's loads of blueberries in there, is there? Oh, I didn't have to buy them at all. <laughs> so what are them other things? Oh, it's grapes. Oh, strawberries. Grapes and strawberries. Grapefruit. And blueberries and cream. And natural yoghurt. No, not cream. I don't like cream. Natural yoghurt. So that's my tea tonight. Wonderful. Or toast. Or toast. Yeah, I don't know what to have is yet. I don't know which I'm going to have yet. I think I need to try this. Yeah, that looks so good. I love stir fries and I love, well, I love curry. And the thought of a Rogan Josh stir fry is just... Mm, 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 mm. Wow. It's time for lunch. I'm getting hungry. So there we go. There's all my five-a-day fruit. Add me yoghurt. I've added my own apple. I do like an apple and to top it off I've got some granola and top it off with granola oh my gosh this looks so good babe I think you'd even like this no, I wouldn't I think you would I've had my five a year <laughs> what, what, what was that then you keep I've had five doner kebabs and everyone every single one you've made has had green in it I've changed my mind Mazzy what now? I'm going to have chilli. Really? I fancy garlic bread. Last time you made oh. garlic bread, it was amazing. So garlic bread and mm -hmm. chilli for tea, please. I can do anything for my baby. And we're on a campsite, you see, so we can use the microwave and do it a lot quicker. Yeah, which is cool. Wonderful. <laughs> right, we've been talking, haven't we? Uh-huh. And we've come up with something quite exciting for us, anyway. And we're hoping it's going to be exciting for you. Yeah. Halloween. 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 A Halloween life special. A Halloween <laughs> life special. Now, Halloween is on a Saturday. Mm -hmm. And what we're planning on, instead of just like being on for an hour and talking about us trip and things, we're going to try and turn it party. into a party. Yeah. So, we're going <laughs> to, every time we see Halloweeny things, we've got this from Lidl. And they sell loads of Halloween snacks and bits and bats and yeah, we want to decorate the place, have a live party, dress with, ourselves up. We're going to dress up and everything. Yeah, have games. Yeah, it's gonna be. We're going to turn Lots it into a, like a full night of it. Let's just yeah. have a proper big Halloween night party. Yeah, definitely. So we've we've just thought about it in the last half hour. Mm -hmm. So we're going to be working on that in the in the next couple of weeks. We've already got the lucky dip and uh, yeah. squash and some lights. We've been getting things, haven't we? I was thinking of a way of trying to get like the children, our fewer children, more involved as well. We'll have to come up with something, won't we? Yeah. If you've had enough of your children and you don't want them anymore, <laughs> send them to me. Send them, them in. Send them in, and we'll cut them up and we'll eat them live yeah. <laughs> for a Halloween special. That's a good idea, Mazzy. Good idea. Maybe, maybe they, maybe they could dress up and send us the pictures, and maybe they could win something. We'll get something special for the who we feel is the dressed, most best dressed up kid. But the problem is they're not going to get dressed up until the night. No, I know that. So we lying. can't announce it until later on and stuff. But for their Halloween, I mean. Yeah, but that ain't going to be in the live, is it? Because they're not going to get dressed up before the live. Okay, we'll have to. We'll come well, up with we'll, something. We'll work it out. We'll yeah. work it out. We'll do something for the kids. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we're excited about that. Something yeah. a bit different, and it's made us think. You know, we're going to start doing party lives. Oh yeah. Cause... Turn it into a night out. We, we thought, we've been thinking about it, we thought like this lunchtime tea with Dan and Mazzy, lunchtime Sunday dinner, is boring. Well, no, we want a party. No, it's gone all right. It's gone <laughs> it's all right. Gone fine. Pe people have enjoyed them, but we think we can pump it up a bit. Yeah, that's what I'm, I won't be rude. I mean, let's just <clears> not have a tea party. Let's have a party. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And we've got a, a live tomorrow night. 
Sunday, 4pm. Oh, yeah. Maybe we've got to come up with some ideas then. We could start Ooh, tomorrow. Oh, I don't know about tomorrow. That's a bit short notice, but we'll see. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we're going to make sure. We're going to try as very, very best to get a good signal and do a live tomorrow for you. Yeah. Anyway, that is it for today. But if you have any Halloween games ideas, ideas. put them in the comments. Yes, please do. Because so, we're a little bit, ooh, we, d we don't really know, yeah. but we want lots of games. We're come, trying to come up with games and ideas to yeah. make the live very special. Entertaining. Uh, the only problem is, what we were thinking is we'll park next to a, a castle or a church or a graveyard yeah, or something. Yeah, or something. But yeah. we can't really go outside with the laptop in the dark. It's not going to work. Because of the so. wind noise. So, yeah. yeah. So we'll see anyway. It's just something we're throwing out there. Any mm. ideas, let us know, please. Yeah. This is the Adair campsite we're on. Can't really show you anything because the beauty about this place is it's all... It's got hedges up and things. So you've got a bit of privacy. You know, you've got your toilet disposal and things over there. The buildings are over there. So yeah, just a nice quiet spot for us tonight. Um, caravan next to us, motorhome behind us, and that looks like it. Beautiful, beautiful evening. Ta da! Ta ta ta! <laughs> right, that was five euros. Now, you can buy them for like 99 pence in, you know, cheap value Asda shops and stuff. Yeah. So, this must be an amazing chili. I think I know what the brand is all about. Ah, is it vegetarian? <laughs> to me, I think it's meat free. There's no meat in your chilli, is there? It tastes a bit tomatoey. Yeah, it's got big blobs well, of tomato. Well, they've got to replace the meat with something. <laughs> Let me just try one more time. It's nice. I'm not going to knock that. No. It tastes meaty. I thought you were going to go mental because there weren't no meat. <laughs> you know me, I love vegetarian... I like vegetarian burgers and things and foods. And I adore garlic bread. I really do. I've got a thing for it at the moment. So thank you very much, darling. Oh, that you're is perfect. You're my perfect. Tea. Thank you. I have been having a very, very, very good look through my chilli. <laughs> There is definitely zero meat in there. Never mind, never mind. It's still beautiful. Before we go, we've got three people we would like to thank very, very much. Danny DeShriver, thank you so Thanks, much. Danny. Steve and Lindsay. A new patron. Oh, welcome to the Madhouse. Thank you, Stephen. And Steph Kelly. And Steph. Steph's the, you know, Steph. Oh, yeah, Steph and the dog. De Bex. Steph and Steph and Dex. Dex. <laughs> I think it's Steph. Yeah, I think it's oh. Kelly. I think that's the same Steph. Thank oh, you thank so, you. so, 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 so much. Right, we're going to leave it there. It didn't go to plan today, but it doesn't always. We're not too bothered. We've enjoyed ourselves. <laughs> We've we're had happy. a good day, yeah. Um, and we're very, very happy on this campsite. So we'll see you all tomorrow for the live. Fingers crossed. We're 93% sure. We're going live at 4 p.m. tomorrow. Join us then. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, what do you do that for? Be a bit spooky. Oh. Mm. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Please comment and hit the like button. That helps our channel grow. If you like what you see, click here to subscribe. Check out this other great video. And if you really want to show your support, join the club, become a Patreon for extra videos and perks. The more support we get, the more content we can give. We'll see you tomorrow on Travel, Travel Trolls, Trolls TV. TV.